What's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today, we have finally got... Actually, let me be honest for a second. This is an extra my account once again. But Julius Randall has been acquired from someone that I know, Mr. Murray DG. Once again, thank you to that man. He has gone through and played TTO until he has unlocked this Julius Randall Galaxy Opal center power forward. Oh my goodness. 98 overall, 99 offense, 95 defense. And he has put a three-point Sean him. He's got a 92 three ball on this 6'8 center power forward Julius Randle. 95 standing and driving dunk. 86 ball handle. 86 pa 87 pass accuracy. 83 steal. 85 perimeter defense. 92 interior defense. 96 for the rebounding. 92 speed. 95 acceleration with the shoe. And an 88 lat. Very, very nice attributes here. For his badges, he's got 34 Hall of Fame and 33 gold. A lot of very good Hall of Fame badges right there. So we're going to do two Triple Threat Online games and see if we can score all 21 points with this Julius Randall Galaxy Opal. Alrighty, guys, and here we go getting into our first game. I decided to pair this card next to uh, Dominique and also AK. Once again, I'm going to have to go into these settings and change it up, but this should be a very good game with this Julius Randall. Alrighty, here we go. We're testing out this Julius Randall. Test out his dribbling a little bit, blow by speed. He's being defended by this Cali Ubro card, which is a card that I haven't actually used yet, so hopefully I'll be able to get him on my own account very shortly, and I'll be able to use a gameplay for him, but so far we'll test out this defense. Okay, he is getting donked on there by Cali Ubre, but I haven't seen that card set, so I haven't actually had a look there. He can curry slide at 6'8", so this is a center power forward that can curry slide, so it's very, very important that you take that into consideration, but so far, starting off the game with a nice easy dunk with his Julius Randall card. Alright, now we've got a steal there, dribbling with AK a little bit, curry slide behind the back from three. We don't get that one to go. A bit unlucky there. So we don't get that first shot to go. I haven't tested his jump shot or anything. I didn't do any freelance. So I might have to take a few shots there to get used to his jump shot originally. Uh, as he's missed that jump shot there, he gets his own rebound. He's going to have to jump out. Good contest there from Julius Randle. We do get the stop. Got a fast break opportunity here. Defended by Kelly, and we do get stopped there. So that's just a dumb shot from me. Uh, that's nothing to do with tendencies or anything. We'll try to get a steal. We can't get a steal. So this guy knows what's up. This, guy's knows, this guy knows what he's doing. So we have to play a little bit better here. We'll try ISO a little bit better. He is off-balling with, uh, with that AK over in the corner. If my Dominique could get out of the way, that would be pretty cool. So we'll do that cross behind the back and get that. He's got very nice dunk packages so far. I haven't looked online to see what they are. But so far, a lot of unblockable, or like somewhat unblockable dunk packages. So we'll play a bit of defense here if we can. Get a nice block there with Julius. He gets it right back, though. We're going to have to try to play a bit more defense here. Uh, he's curry sliding behind the back. Dominique, we know he's a very good card. If you guys haven't seen the Dominique gameplay, highly recommend going and have a look at that card because he's very, very nice indeed, as well as the AK. I haven't, I haven't actually used the AK before on my own account as he's using the AK from deep. Doesn't get that one to go. And a bit of a bit of a mishap there. We didn't end up getting the rebound. Try this curry slide behind the back from deep, 34%, and it doesn't go in. That's fair, though. From a bit deeper there, and we green that shot. So you can see he does have a bit of range. He is a very nice shooter. Uh, I want to get a few steals here, maybe a few more stops. We'll try to play a bit better deep. Defense, great pass inside there. I'm not sure if he meant to pass to a uh, Karolinko inside there, but we'll try get a few more possessions with uh, with this or Julius Randall. Try maybe another curry behind the back. There we go. There he's not playing up. He does 67% there, so a bit of a terrible shot actually. We'll play a bit, a bit of defense. Great, uh, great interception there. We've got AK pass back to the top to Julius Randall. The stop and pop is very good there, and we've got 10 early points now with this Julius Randall card. Actually, just as I was about to finish that clip, we get a uh, get a steal straight away, get a glass taking takeover with this Julius Randall, and we get another two points off the steal there, so very, very good start here for this Julius Randall card, I feel like he wants to dish outside here, this guy wants his three ball he might step out of bounds there, he doesn't we're a bit unlucky there, this guy definitely wants his three ball here, so we're clamping him with this Julius Randall, that defense, that perimeter defense is coming into full effect there, and we get another steal with that Hall of Fame intimidator, sorry, Hall of Fame interceptor the step back three is no good, we could see that appear, so I made sure to jump over there with AK. We'll try that again. Try source him up a little bit. Get that quick first step. AK's under the 
pain, a little bit of a jitter step there, and we get the slam to go. So 14 points now, and this uh, he's got one of his players, the Frank Nilikita. He is cold at the moment, uh, so we'll try to get another steal potentially. No, we don't get to read that one, and he's going to make that shot with AK. So we're up by five here. We've got a little bit of breathing room with this Julius Randle. We'll try maybe go for another curry side. I want to see how well it is. He's expecting me to shoot that, the side step there, and we get the green three to go. So this jump shot is very, very nice. I'm not going to lie. It's a very nice jump shot. Uh, I highly recommend it. I'll give my proper review after each game, but for now, I'm really enjoying the card. Alright, we'll try to finish this game off as soon as possible. Get a little courage slide. I was hoping he's going to switch over there. We'll try another drive. He gets that similar light. That's a similar light player package that we had with Dominique. If you guys once again haven't seen that Dominique video, we had the problem with a lot of driving dunks were ending up in uh, ending up in driving layups. A lot of them were like kind of weird looking layups. I'm going to try to read that dunk there. Uh, go inside. The defense is no good. Uh, but with, yeah, so I'm wondering whether or not that's a tendency thing or maybe once again, it's just a poor take by me. But we're going to try to get another curry slide. We get the curry side to go. That jump shot seemed a bit later that time. Maybe it was a bit further out, but we do get it to go. So one more point here, and we'll be able to get the 21 points with this Julius Randle. Alrighty, I reckon it's time to call game here with this Julius Randle. Curry side. I was hoping he's going to switch back on there. He's not defending the paint, but we get stopped by Frank Nilikita there. We're going to have to reset a little bit here. His stamina is actually quite good for dribbling. So this is a center power forward. As I say that, he gets stopped. But he's actually he's a power forward, and he gets quite good stamina, which is very interesting. However, we'll jump into another game. We'll do a second game of TTO, and uh, we'll see if we can get more points and even score 22 points with this Julius Randle card. Alrighty, and getting into game number two here with this Julius Randle card. We'll try to score as many points as we can. This guy's got Mallow defending him. Uh, the pink diamond Mallow, that is, as we get a uh, pretty fancy dunk there. It's going to have a lot of showtime and highlight film possibilities coming out of it. So a great dunk there to start the game. But this guy has rim running constantly with this Clyde Drexler. So I'm going to have to play a bit bit of defense in order to stop him from getting those drives. However, he is playing on ball, which is a lot better than what the guy was doing last game. I got the pump fake then. I, I, I knew I had the crab, but I, um, I, I thought after the pump fake, we weren't going to hit that shot, but we do manage to get it go as this guy continuously is running towards the rim. I've got to stop him at some point. I can't just let him keep running towards the rim, but we'll try get a few get a few shots here. Another crab there. Oh, he got around me. That's a bit unlucky, but we still managed to hit the shot. 38% contested, and then we hit that three. So this card is very, very nice. Alrighty, on the break now with this Clyde Drexler. Got the Carmelo going everywhere, but in front of us, Clyde Drexler is trying to defend the rim, but we get a beautiful dunk over him now. I, well, I know he wants to go to this Clyde. Oh, I was hoping to get a steal there, but we've got, uh, got nine quick points here with this card as he takes a contested shot with Clyde, and I'm not there to get the rebound. I'm going to jump out there for Paul George. Great jump from AK there, and we managed to snag the board with... Actually, I want to shoot this. I want, I want to pull back and shoot this. We take the deep. That's a very deep shot. Unfortunately, it was time a little bit differently because of how deep it was. Got to jump out there, make sure this guy isn't getting any easy buckets. Got to get inside. Great defense here. Fantastic defense from this team. Perfect defense in a 3v3 setting. Pull up in transition with... Oh, he's missed the shot with that Julius Randle card. It was quite a good pull up, to be fair. We'll get the contested shot there. This guy's taken a lot of very contested looks, but we're going um, to be playing pretty good defense here. I want to get another step back with his curry slide, if possible. We'll, uh, we'll curry slide maybe into a rim run here. Actually, he's done quite well here. We might call for a quite call for a screen here and see what we can do with a with a with a pick real quick. Dominique coming over, setting this pick, the switch from Clyde. All right, pretty good defense there. We're gonna have to set a fade, maybe reset this play, kick it back out to Julius Randle, get our stamina back. To be fair, like for a send for a power forward center, the stamina is pretty damn good. Like I, I can't complain about it. Uh, Curry slide, get him crab there, and perfect shot. So you can treat this Julius Randle like a point guard. Like you guys can see, uh, with an 86 ball handle, you can dribble very very well with him. You can get that curry slide. You can you can blow by defenders with a quick first step on Hall of Fame. Like you can get a lot of good animations with this card. It is, it is a very very nice card. I'm not like gonna I'm not gonna lie. Um, you can as you can see there the three point rating is out of the roof. But we do. I was gonna say we, I thought we were gonna miss that shot, but we do make that very deep range shot. Something I am noticing though, compared to a lot of other jump shots, his jumper is slowing down a lot more the further you go out. So say you do a curry slide and you take a few steps back from the perimeter. He's getting very, very slow. Like his jumper gets very.
very, very slow the further that you go out. I'm going to try get past this guy. Maybe go back this way. But yeah, I was going to say, he's expecting me to go that way. The 360 between the legs with this Julius Randle on takeover. He wants to go to this Dominator uh, with this Clyde Drexler. I know he does. All right, we'll, we'll, we might put him on ball, actually. Well, we'll try we'll try get a bump steal there. But unfortunate. Great defense. But that Clyde Drexler is a very, very good card as well. So props to this guy. He knows what he's doing with this card. I think he knows that I'm trying to source with this, uh, with this Julius Randle. We'll get a step back, though. From deep. That's very, very deep. And we don't get that one to go on for. So we'll play a bit more defense here and hopefully score some more points with this Julius Randle. Alrighty, a one point game here. We're going to score as much as we can. I really wish I could score with these other cards, but I think this guy knows that I just want to score with this Julius Randle. Step backs, curry slide, very good contest there. And I could see that that was off. So this guy's contesting very, very well here. Oh, he's done the curry slide himself here. All right, got to play a bit better defense here. So he's he, that zigzag and through is it's, it's it's pretty impossible to stop with Clyde Drexler. So we're losing this lead here. He's up by a point, so we have to score this possession. Easy cut to the rim. At what? I, okay, I didn't didn't expect that sort of animation to come come forward, but we get a bit of a bit of a weird animation there. We don't get the interception. I know he wants to go back to this Clyde Drexler. He might have. I thought he was going to attempt that uh, that oop there. We get a bump there, but we don't get the ball inside, and he gets the slam to go. I don't want to lose. This isn't my account by the way this is Murray's account who's been uh, who's been um, nice enough to let me borrow it so I've uh, and I've turned the ball over again I've turned absolute shambles this game uh, jump out there or oh, he cannot score at all Paul George ends the game right there so unfortunately our second game doesn't go to plan as much as our first but we'll jump in the main menu and I'll give you guys my final review on this Galaxy Opal Julius Randle Alright guys, to finish up, this card is absolutely top tier. I love him to death. This card plays like a point guard. He can handle like a point guard. He doesn't have the exact speed of a point guard. Now, Murray has put that shoe on him as I have said before. That does get his acceleration up into the high, was it the 90s? Yeah, 95. So, quite a good acceleration with this card. 92 speed and that 86 ball handle is really going to come into effect, especially being 6'8". Kind of handles like a, like a bigger KD in a way um, and can obviously drain that shot, especially with the shoe put on him. So guys, I highly recommend him. This card is completely free, as you guys know, but it is people are finding it quite hard to obtain this card. So if you do happen to get him, try him out. See if you like his dual moves. As I said, the one downside that I found is especially with his jump shot, the further you're getting out, it's slowing down a lot. It's slowing down a lot more than what I've noticed with other jump shots throughout this game. But guys, besides that, this, this, this card is absolutely phenomenal, especially for a free card. I really, really enjoy it. So guys, let me know if you have this Julius Randle down below in the comments. And if you want to check out Murray as well, once again, thank you to Murray. You can see his PSN in the top corner. Go check him out. His Twitter will be in the link in the description. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.